So this is going to be a bit of a brief video because there's not really much for me to talk about here. I just want to get the news out there and then I want to provide my opinion. So first off, before we get into what happened, if you don't know my whole thing with Terraria on Switch, I've made a few videos on Terraria on Switch. And basically, to sum up my stance on it, I think that Terraria is a really fun game. I've been playing it for a very long time. And I think that it making its way onto the Switch would be just great. If I remember, I'll have some links in the description or maybe some cards. And I'll have links to my other Terraria videos. However, I want to talk about the new piece of news that has come out in Nintendo's Indie Highlight Session. So yesterday on Nintendo UK, they held an Indie Highlight Session, which it's kind of weird that they just held it on the UK channel. However, they did announce some things that were kind of interesting. One of the exceptions that was not terraria on switch because overall i thought that the conference was it wasn't it wasn't terrible i just thought that it was a nice update on the new indie games coming to switch the only real games that i was really hyped for was this war of mine which i played on pc and i really liked it and of course terraria on the switch there was a very very quick trailer which looks like it wasn't really made incredibly like i, I what i mean is that i don't think it was took like months to make. I think that this was just a quick update that Pipeworks just wanted to inform everyone on. And it's a small trailer just showing a Nintendo Switch playing Terraria with the, tra the trailer of Terraria and then text that says 2019. So that's all it said. So there's a lot we can take from this, but there's one big thing that I really need to talk about first. I made a lot of videos talking about of how I think Terraria was going to come out in 2018. And there was a comment that was left on my latest Terraria video on the Switch, which was a few months ago, actually. And it was just basically, it, it wasn't really anything too huge. However, it, a lot of people did think it might have had some significance. And I feel like I should mention it because for everyone who saw that, you're probably going to be thinking, well, maybe it was right. So if you don't know what's going on or what happened, basically on Newegg.com, there was a placeholder date for Terraria on the Switch, and it said that it would be coming out on March 29th, 2019. And that's pretty much, it was, from what I could tell, it looked like a placeholder date. I have I did that before where I jumped to conclusions thinking that this was a confirmed date. I really just, it's, it is possible that there's this very small chance, but it is possible that we could be seeing Terraria on the Switch launching in March of 2019, and because there was no month actually given in this trailer, it just said 2019. However, there's been placeholder dates for Nintendo Switch games and games in general on Amazon, and probably Newegg in the past too. So, this is most likely just a placeholder date, so don't get your hopes up to see it in March. So, I don't really know how to feel about this, because I was pretty confident that the game was coming out after being delayed in 2017 and 2018. However, things happen, and Pipeworks does have a lot of work on their hands, so it does make sense that they may have to push back other versions to focus on, like they said, uh, like the mobile version, for example. And the Nintendo Switch version, like someone in the comments said, is just going to have to wait. And after hearing that, I was starting to become less and less confident that we were going to see it in 2018, and now that the, a confirmed date in 2019 is on the horizon, I think that at this point, we are not going to be seeing any, we're not going to be seeing the project any earlier than, in my opinion, I think we're not going to see it any earlier than maybe quarter two 2019, because I feel like quarter two is a pretty safe bet. Quarter one, maybe, but I feel like quarter two would be, just like I said, a safer bet, because then we can have an expectation that if maybe, maybe Pipeworks will release the game earlier then they'll exceed our expectations. But it is possible that we could see the game once again delayed to later 2019. But being honest, when they just say 2019, it could be anywhere in that year. So, like I said, I think we could see it in quarter two, but it could really come out at any... They could release it December 31st, 2019, and it still wouldn't be delayed. This is exciting, though, because I was kind of getting a bit worried that the game... I wasn't thinking it had been cancelled because... The, just the chances of it, it being cancelled were pretty low. But the fact that we weren't hearing a whole lot kind of was making me a bit worried. But hearing this is just a new spark of hope and excitement to play this game on the Switch. And I've said this a lot. I've said this many times in the past with games coming to Switch. If it's going to be on a portable console, and if it's going to be on a portable console as powerful as the Nintendo Switch, 
then it might actually just be the ideal version to play it on. Anyways, despite that, I hope you guys enjoy this video. If you want to check out my comments, but despite that, I hope you did enjoy this video. If you want to check out the description, I'll have the articles and my social medias link there. And if you enjoyed this video, please share it on social media. And again, I hope you enjoyed this video. And see you.